everybody, it's Kinsey. Welcome back to Canon Gaming. Today I'm going to be doing a video that one of you guys requested is how to be rich and adopt me. Okay, shout out to you. Also guys, if you have a parrot, you should see their offer. It's super good. So um, big shout out to you and thank you so much for the... So these five tips that I'm going to be showing you guys is literally how I have gotten all my pets. So I'll show you guys like a quick inventory. This is like how I got all my pets is just using these tips and tricks. So let's just hop into it. But before we start, I would love you so much if you guys could give this video a like and subscribe down below. Also, Alex's birthday is probably, I think, the day that you guys are watching this. So if you guys want to wish him a happy birthday down below in the comments, um, I think he'd very much appreciate it. So yeah, let's just hop into this video. Um, so yeah. Also, a quick reminder, um, the Robodog, um, Winner has two day, you know, one day now to um claim a prize, and basically how you have to claim it though um I will not be sending them a friend request until they let, just comment something. They can literally just um send a blank comment um just so I know that they're active and they're able to claim it. If they do not claim it, I will have to be choosing a new winner. And the B person, the B giveaway winner um has five days to claim her B. So again, you just have to comment just so I know that you'll be active um, so I can easily just give it to you. So yeah, that's basically how you get it. So let's just hop into the video. Um, so I'm going to be showing you guys all the tips. So yeah. Okay, tip one. Now this tip is probably the tip I like using the most and it's being a baby um, and earning lots of money. Now, why would you wanna earn money? Money is, it's not really, I mean, obviously you'd be rich that way, but like I wanna be rich with my pets. Well, I'm glad you asked because basically doing this little tactic, you are saving up money to buy eggs and you can trade what's in the egg for different pets and grow your way up from there and even possibly get some um, legendaries and trade those to maybe get like your dream pet or something. So I think it's just a very helpful tip in my opinion just to save the money up and get eggs. So that's what I've been doing with the ocean eggs and I already have five out of the eight pets that I need. So it's definitely super good. Also guys if you have any of the ocean pets a lot of people are overpaying for them right now. So I would tra try to trade them now before like it's completely gone. I like trading my duplicates so yeah, if you guys have an offer for a narwhal, um, just let me know down below. So basically, that's just like a little t my first tip is just saving tons of money. And going along with this is doing like, um, you could do like the common to legendary challenge, which does take a while. It's not my favorite thing. But definitely, if you guys are patient, I definitely suggest it. So yeah, let's move on to tip two. The second tip is honestly super helpful in my opinion and literally can make you so rich so you guys might see these on youtube but basically we're going say i think the videos they call it like growing my inventory with like um like i saw a video where they did it with a mega turtle basically um say your best pet is a uh, a dodo bird say you traded the dodo bird for um two robo dogs and then you traded one of the robo dogs for another dodo bird and then technically you just got a free robo dog so basically doing this, you are getting tons of free pets and it just like depends. You could go way wild or you could just try to trade it and try to get some overpaid offers um, and just stop there. If like, say you don't like the pet, but if you, I don't know, but yeah, definitely suggest doing that. I think I'm going to try to do that later to get some good pets. Just like this, I got this turtle from doing that guys, a turtle from doing it. And those are definitely going up in value. So I definitely suggest trying to do this if, um, you want to and definitely it's a little bit more easier especially if you're doing your best pet if you're doing your worst pet it might not be as easy because if you're doing your best pet then um you're gonna get a lot of good offers so yeah that's just my suggestion on that and i wouldn't suggest doing like a like a very good pet maybe like a unicorn or like a kind of bad legendary that's my suggestion so yeah now let's move on to tip number three Tip number three is to make those neons guys because say you were using the first tip and you have been hatching tons of eggs and you have four of the same pet definitely people are going to give you good offers for the neon so level the pet up which you're making the money so you can buy even more eggs maybe be a baby while you level it up so you're really kind of staying the first one um getting the money so you can buy even more eggs um level it up and then make it to a neon and say like you probably could trade a neon cat for like a metal ox and bam you already have a metal ox and you just have to um 
like do some adopt me work and you've gotten some money and you might even have gotten like a legendary from how many eggs you've opened so this tip is honestly really helpful and definitely suggest trying to make neons whenever you can right now i'm using i mainly using the first and the second one because i'm not really trading i am um, getting money i have my pet out who try to make a neon so definitely just suggest doing um this one because if you have any four pets definitely just try to make them into a neon so that's just my suggestion now let's move on to tip four tip four now this is a mistake i feel like a lot of people do is they definitely overpay for items which i guess is good for the other person but definitely not for you if you're overpaying for an item you're technically losing a good item and it really can make your inventory go down a lot in value um i've done this a few times in my i might even would have like an evil unicorn by now it's just a big thing you really have to make sure like okay even if you want the pet a lot i guess you can overpay but if you just are really trying to get rich, don't try to, like, trade an evil unicorn for, like, a unicorn. Just a regular one. Really try to think about the values and try to make completely fair trades. Now, this one I can't really help too much, but definitely don't, like, trade. Especially, like, the ocean pets. You can get, get big overpays right now. Um, so, don't, like, a literally... The, like the stingrays are going to be with ground sloths and tasmanian tigers very soon and somebody offered me a robodog for mine so definitely try not to do those trades um like definitely if you can take the overpays but i wouldn't suggest um like i don't know like just don't take bad offers especially for the ocean of pets you might really want one but still, just really try to think about it because soon you'll be able to get, like, 200 of them and you're going to not like them. So that's tip four. Let's move on to the last and final tip. And my last and final tip, also known as tip five, def last but definitely not least, is to save your, like, buy a lot of eggs to save them. Obviously, I don't have any ocean eggs saved because I'm trying to hatch them, get the pets, and hopefully get the overpaid offers. Um, but, like, if you save the the gumball machine pets if the aussie egg was perhaps leaving like i don't have the jungle egg the farm egg any of that i came when the um, aussie egg was like about to leave so yeah um say the aussie egg is about to leave collect your aussie eggs i'm definitely not as proud as i am with the fossil eggs but um I, yeah collect these because already these are going up in value people are trading like good legendaries for these eggs um so definitely suggest getting them like safari eggs they literally have gone up so much in value so definitely suggest that i just got 10 fossil eggs to save which isn't a lot but i definitely don't open or trade these a lot i'm waiting for them to rise in value so definitely save those eggs so that one was a tip that honestly can be really helpful because in two years if like adopt me in two years those aussie eggs will be worth literally so much guys so definitely suggest doing that um um, but thank you guys so much. Or if there's a safari egg, definitely pay a lot. Don't just put in, like, a cat because it's not a regular egg. It's been out of the game for, like, two years now. But, um, yeah, um, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Um, I really hope these tips help you out. Um, and, yeah, um, maybe try them for a week and see how much richer you've got because, trust me, there will be a difference in your inventory. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I will see all you amazing people next time. Bye, guys.